Okay, hey Sagittarius, so this is going to be your reading for the month of March. Okay, Spirit, what messages do you have here for Sag? So we have it's time to transform. And we have prioritize your health. And we have loosen your grip. Wow. Somebody is afraid of losing weight. It's something in regards to like identity. Somebody's identity here. Somebody is afraid to lose weight here. You could be a weight loss coach or something like that here. But somebody is afraid to lose weight because like it's something in regards to control. What's going on here with Sagittarius? Wow, that's too many. What's going on here? What's going on here? Wow. You could have gotten to it with this person here. You got in to it with somebody or somebody is accusing you of being a bad friend or something like that. Wow. Wow, because you're trying to help this person. Something in regards to like this person's diet could be significant here. You're trying to encourage this person to get healthy. But this individual could be upset with you. Somebody is upset with you here. Wow, this person feels like you are too strict. So you could definitely be like a weight loss coach here or something like that. But somebody feels like you are too strict or something like that here. This person is afraid to lose weight as well. What's going on here? Could be a masculine energy you are dealing with. So this person could have like lashed out at you or somebody just like got upset or this person got really emotional. This person could have got emotional during like a workout session or something like that here. While I'm here procrastination, like somebody is like procrastinating here or something like that. What's going on here? It's something in regards to this person's like full potential here. What's going on here? Yeah, somebody could be very impulsive here as well. Like you're trying to help this person, but somebody is like, this person is not wanting to get healthy or somebody is getting upset with you. You're trying to give this person some type of advice, but like, this person doesn't want your advice or they don't want your help or somebody is just getting upset with you or something like that. What's going on here? Somebody feels like you are pushing them like too hard here as well. Yep. Wow. This person also like doesn't want to take accountability or something in regards to excuses. This person makes a lot of excuses when it comes to weight loss, but I'm really getting like this person has a fear of losing weight. Somebody is afraid to lose weight. If this person can have like issues in regards to control, like somebody feels like if they lose weight, then they aren't going to be in control of their environment. This person likes to be in control of their environment or something like that. Whoever this individual is, yeah. You feel like this person has no follow through. So I'm definitely speaking to somebody that's like a fitness coach. It's not that this person is lazy. This person is scared. Somebody is like scared to lose weight. What's going on here? Yep. Look here. You could also feel like this person is like uh, stubborn here. Or this person could be like wanting to like, I'm here and give up on some type of weight loss journey. Wow, it's about your, okay. So I'm getting something in regards to like this person feeling like you're pushing them. But it's something in regards to like your delivery or somebody feels like you are pushing them too hard. But I'm getting, it's like, look at the situation from a different perspective because this person is not lazy. This person is actually scared to lose weight. Somebody is afraid to lose weight here. Why is this person afraid to lose weight here, spirit? Wow. 
Wow. It's change. This person is afraid of change. That's what it is. This person is afraid of change. Yep. This person is afraid of change. This person, this person could also feel like if they lose weight, then somebody that they are dealing with is not going to want to be with them or something like that here. So this individual could also be dealing with something like a relationship or something like that. Like you aren't even aware of this. This could be like a friend of yours or for some, this is somebody like you don't even know. But this person is trying to lose weight and every time they start seeing any type of improvement, this person like gets anxiety. Somebody gets anxiety really bad whenever they start to lose weight. So this person like self-sabotages, but I'm also getting somebody could be dealing with a third party that's trying to make them feel guilty or make them feel like if they lose weight, then they aren't going to be desirable. So somebody is afraid to get in shape as well. You know, a pot of roses, they fit. Anything else here, spirit? Wow. This person could have been dealing with somebody that told them if they lose any more weight or something like that, then like they're going to go out and cheat on them or something like that here. Whoever I'm really getting, I'm speaking to somebody that's like a fitness coach. This could be like a client of yours and you wonder why this person is like constantly procrastinating here. This person could have a fear of losing weight here. But I'm also getting this person could be dealing with somebody that's trying to make them feel like if they lose weight or get in shape, then they're going to like break up with them or something like that. Somebody could be in a relationship with somebody that's like not such a nice person. Somebody that's manipulative. Somebody that's abusive here. So be mindful. Yep. Confirmation. Yeah. Yep. You cannot make this up. Whoever this individual is in a relationship with. This person, yeah, this person does not want this individual to lose weight here. Somebody is like trying to sabotage somebody's like weight loss journey or something like that here. That's not going to be for everyone. For some, you are dealing with somebody that like has anxiety in regards to like, this person could like, it's something in regards to stability or this person does not like change. So somebody could be having anxiety watching their body change like as they lose weight. And for some, you are dealing with somebody that's dealing with a third party that's trying to make this person feel insecure about losing weight. What advice do you have here for Sagittarius? Yeah, we have, it's not about being perfect. It's about being real. What advice do you have here? Yeah, challenge yourself to discover something new about yourself and the world around you every day. Sag, this is somebody that you are currently dealing with. This person is trying to make you feel like you shouldn't lose weight. Or they're trying to make you feel like you aren't going to be desirable if you lose weight and get in shape or get healthy. This could be like you want to eat a healthier lifestyle and it's causing you to lose weight and somebody could be like trying to make you feel insecure about that. Yep, could be dealing with somebody that's controlling here with this loosen your grip. I'm telling you. Take your power back here. You're trying to be mindful in regards to your diet. Yeah, closer to my dreams. I'm also hearing like your dream goal or something like that. For some, I'm really getting like you could just be eating healthier here. You're cutting out sugar. You're cutting out fast food. You're cutting out starch. You're cutting out processed food. And you're losing weight here. And somebody is watching your body transform here. And whoever this individual is, they don't like it. Yeah, that's too many. What advice do you have here for Sag? Yeah, we have November. 
we have Friday here. And we have, you don't have to be perfect. I'm telling you, trust the process here, Sag. is no such thing as perfect as well. You could have been up in your head in the past as well in regards to a situation or in regards to your body. Take things slow here as well. It's a process. I'm also getting get out and mingle and meet up with your soul tribe here as well. There's nothing wrong with that, but I'm going to end it there, Sag. Best of luck if this is you dealing with this or somebody around you.